Looking good, looking saucy, looking like a good hit here. And... Ooh. Hello YouTube, Komodo Gaming here, bringing you guys another episode of Stormworks Build and Rescue, and yes folks, we're back once again, and today we are going to be checking out a brand new experimental update. So... There have been AI ships added to Stormworks. Uh, this is something that I've wanted to see for a long time, and we're gonna go screw around with them and see if we can crash them, because that's what we do in Stormworks. Now, there is some other things to the experimental update. There's some information about some parts. Uh, definitely go check out the patch notes. Uh, but AI ships was a big thing for me. So that's not the only thing we're gonna be checking out. We have the Razor Crest. Uh, this is from the Mandalorian, and there better be a Baby Yoda on this thing. So we're going to use this to go track down the AI ships and we're going to mess with them? I don't know, supposedly the AI ships have a little bit more simple physics compared to the player. I guess in order to allow them to be out there to not be laggy, so uh, we'll see what that means. We might have to spawn a tsunami on them and just see what happens. But anyways, if you guys are enjoying Stormworks on the channel, maybe hit that thumbs up button, it helps out my channel. And let's check out this uh, Razor Crest. Ah, look at this. By the way, I'll have a link down in the description for the Razor Crest. It's made by Cod Cape. So let's see. Is there a Baby Yoda aboard? Wait, this is a little hatch for Baby Yoda. No, no. I wonder where he's at. Okay, so you got that. You've got the little uh, slabs here for the bounties. Um, Baby Yoda. I wonder if it's up maybe in the uh, the cockpit somewhere. This is actually kind of impressive looking. Like, this is so accurate looking. You got the little bedroom here. You got the little bounties on the wall. Uh, the gun locker, I th think, is right here. So it's an equipment locker. Look at that. Oh, that's cool. So we can go up here. Uh, is there a Baby Yoda? Oh, what's this? Hallway light, okay. The storage room here. Is, is Baby Yoda somewhere back here? No. Uh, turn on some lights here. Maybe he's in the... Oh, you gotta be kidding me. <laughs> There's a baby Yoda in here. <laughs> oh dear. Okay, so we have that. All right, let's get this thing fired up real quick. Let's see. Let's go cockpit lights on. All right, so engines are right there. There's landing lights. Not required, but we're turning them on anyways. Identification lights are on. Uh, let's see. Here's your throttle. Okay, so I think we're about ready to go here. So let's turn on powers here. Power on. Okay, avionics on. All right, here we go. Engines one and two are on. Looking good. Radar power on. So there's a mode on here. You've got your uh, overdrive mode, which guzzles fuel. Huh. I'm going to have to use that. All right, so we're fired up. Oh, this looks so cool. All right, let's go ahead and try to move forward a little bit here. It's going to take a second. Actually, I think we need to throttle up on the one side here. So should we go to full? Uh, okay, there's the thruster spoiler. Alright, she's powering up. Let's see if we can ease her out of the, uh, the old, uh, hangar here. Alright, oh, oh, move that back. There's the thruster spoiler. Uh-oh, uh-oh, we're dragging bottom. There we go. Okay, this isn't the smoothest thing for me. Oh, what am I doing? What am I doing? Override. Okay, there's- oh, dear. Alright, we have just murdered baby Yoda. Yeah, that- we made it, a, a really far ways there, Han. Is he okay? Yeah, look at him, he's fine. You know, I should probably read the instructions on this before I do something like that. Yep, just as I suspected, Komodo did not follow the instructions. So, I read them over now, and I, I believe I have an understanding as to how this is supposed to go. Uh, yeah, that was my bad. Alright, so we're ready to go. So, thruster spoiler is supposed to be at zero, and then I hold S in order to lift off here, which I'm actually doing. Okay, there it goes. Alright, we need to do a little overdrive here. Oh, oh there we go. Alright, so we are in the air. Oh boy, oh, this is a nimble craft. Holy man. That's actually really neat looking. Alright, so the uh, landing gear automatically went up. That's so cool. Uh, I don't think we're going to be landing this on a uh, ship or even crashing it into it. We might have to get a different creation out, but I wanted to really check this thing out. So this thing doesn't have any sort of like VTOL mode or anything, so we're pretty much flying kind of like a jet. So I don't know how hard it's going to be to actually uh, maybe hit some of the AI ships. All right, we are scanning the horizon. So we're in the experimental build. So the AI ships should be here somewhere. I don't know how often they spawn in. It's a good question. Uh, oh, is that one? Oh, there's one right there. 
Oh man, that's so cool. That's one of the things that Stormworks really needed because you've got this big, awesome world, yet it feels so not alive because the only ships you see are the uh, ships in the missions. But yeah, that is an AI ship there. So it's actually driving around. It's going to go do its thing. Uh, are there NPCs on it? Oh, that's too awesome. I kind of want to crash this into it. I wonder if Baby Yoda's ready. Baby Yoda, are you ready for this? All right, so we've seen one. All right, so it's back there. Question is, how many do you get clustered in? Is there like another one nearby? Or are they few and far between? Uh, do keep in mind, it's really early. Uh-oh, I might crash here. On, 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 save it. On, pull up, pull up. Uh, I should probably get out of the overdrive mode. Oh, there we go. That's the overdrive mode. Oh, dear. Oh, that's so awesome. So, yeah. Um, wait, actually, do we have a fuel gauge? I need to look at the fuel gauge. Okay. It's... It's guzzling. It's not too bad. No, we're fine. So, yeah, I'm kind of curious how many they spawn in at once. Like, is it one and it's like you're not going to see one for a while? Or maybe you'll see multiple? Or are we going to see, like, big tankers? I know it's all really early on. Oh, there's another one right there. Oh, that's a, uh, that's an oil tanker. Or at least I think that's what that is. Uh, let's go to overdrive mode. Turn that off there. Oh, boy. Dude, this thing handles actually really good. Like... This is pretty ridiculous. All right, I don't think we're going to land on it. I mean, I could do the spoiler angle up. Maybe that's what turns it into more of a VTOL mode. So if I engage this up, what does this do? Does it kind of hover? Oh, no. That was a mistake. That was a... Okay, let's not do that. Uh, Baby Yoda's drowning right now. Uh, those people are going to hate me for that one. Wait, can we take it back off? No, it sounds like it's dead. Wait. Is that a chip? Is it using his horn? I swear I hear a horn on the surface. I think the ship over there is using a horn. Okay, we're going to attempt this one more time. We're going to try to crash the Razor Crest into a ship. If not, we're going to go get a helicopter and we're going to land on top. And then we'll probably hit it with the tsunami. So stay tuned for that. All right, we are back in the air once again. Oh, once you learn how to take this thing off, it's actually really satisfying to jab on that, uh, that overdrive. Okay, so let's go find ourselves a ship. So one more thing I want to test out here. We do have a weapon system. I don't think it actually shoots anything, but I could be wrong. So it's a primary weapon. What does it do? Oh, it's like lasers. You can see them coming out the front. Makes sense because of Star Wars, but yeah, it would be kind of cool if there was uh, missiles here. All right, let's see if we can spot another AI ship. So one thing I did see, I think the ships are pretty persistent because this ship was by this oil rig earlier. It's the same ship, I believe. Uh, so yeah, that's actually really cool to see. All right, so what we're gonna do, we're gonna try to crash into it. So the question is, do they have crash physics on the AI ships? Like, can we catch them on fire? Does it turn into a mission? I don't know. Uh-oh. Okay, here we go. All right, Razor Crest versus AI ship. Here we go. And... Oh, no! <laughs> of course I would miss it. Oh, boy. All right, folks, we're angled in for another hit here. We've got to run this into the side of this ship. All right, looking good, looking saucy, looking like a good hit here. And, ooh, there it goes. Oh, what the heck? <laughs> oh, no. Oh, we need to escape. I'm sorry, Baby Yoda. I've got to leave you in here. <laughs> oh, people are going to be mad about that. Okay, come on. Oh, I am not getting out of this thing. Oh, okay. Hold on, I should have got the, uh, oh, I should have got the little breathing mask. Oh, yeah, we're dead. Yep, yep. That's the thing. So, I didn't see damage to the ship. We flipped it over and something flew off of it. And, oh, this is awkward. Uh, the dock's looking at me. So, let's go find that ship real quick. I'm curious if we actually took it down. Like, if you could sink AI ships, that would be a thing. All right, we are coming back to the ship. It appears that it's still up. I mean, we flipped it over. And I don't think I saw any damage on it, so that's not a thing yet. Now, maybe down the line you'll be able to do that. Maybe catch the enemy, or I say enemy, the AI ships on fire. I mean, I guess you can make them enemy ships. That'd be kind of cool. But yeah, let's go down and see if there's any damage on it. All right, this is definitely the ship that we hit. Uh, it doesn't appear to have any damage. They're good. They're trucking along. Everything's fine. All right, so we're going to attempt to land on it because... Yeah, I want to be aboard it. Uh, let's go ahead and open that up, just in case we have to jump out. Uh, all right, get close, get close. Uh, oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. Okay, we got this. Wait, is there damage on it? 
Wait, I think there is. Look, there's damage at the top. So I wonder if you can sink uh, AI ships. I mean, you might be able to. I thought we hit it more square, but no, there's actual damage. All right, here we go. We're about to land. Oh, boy. Okay, come down. Come down. Come down. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, that was... That was actually decent. I mean, that's about as good as you're gonna get without an actual landing pad. Uh, oh, we might wanna jump off this real quick. Uh, oh boy, am I stuck? I better not be stuck. There's a chance we're stuck here, folks. Hold on, let's see, can we open this door? Oh, there it goes. Hey, buddy, we're just here to hijack your ship. Is there anybody aboard? Oh, there is somebody aboard. So yeah, we can walk up here. Can I, can I pilot this? F for captain. Hello, captain. Can I light your ship on fire? Yeah, there's damage on it. Oh, is there other people aboard? This is so cool. So they have their own little ships here. So, yeah. Could you imagine if there was like, I mean, I want to say this is ambitious. If there was like cruise ships and stuff like that. I mean, I already saw a tanker, so we know there's bigger ships. All right, let's see how the AI can handle the uh, big waves. All right, AI, drive me. Uh oh, no, no, oh, no. I think I want to come in there with you, buddy. Uh oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay, can we close this door, please? Uh, let's close the door. Close. Okay, we close the door. Oh, no, I'm here with the crazy... Uh-oh. Well, we just capsized the AI's boat. No, we're going back this way. This is fine. Uh, what does this look like? <laughs> oh, the waves are pretty big here. So, yes, the AI... Uh, it seems to have like the same physics as far as the, uh, the waves here. Like They're flying around like we would. Like, this is pretty impressive right now. All right, let's see what the AI does against, I don't know, everything else, like a tsunami and some megalodons. Like, do the megalodons actually attack the AI ships since they have an engine? Or at least I'm assuming they have an engine in here. By the way, I want to set down. <laughs> uh, I want to feel safe here. Dude, this is cool. We're actually going with the AI. Like, I wonder if somebody's going to do a video where they just jump in with the AI and see where they end up. Uh, by the way, I think there's megalodons back there, potentially. This is fine. Here comes the tsunami. What's the AI going to do here? Like, I'm assuming the AI is just set on their path, and they're going to just keep going no matter what. Uh, they're going to completely ignore the whole fact there's a big tidal wave heading their way. This is fine. All right, here it comes. We've got a huge tsunami. I don't see the megalodons that we spawned in, so I'm not sure if they're going after the AI or not, but this guy's trying to fight it. Oh, no. Wait, he's turning. Oh, is he trying to avoid the tsunami? Like, I feel like he's trying to ride it. Oh, dear. Oh, this is not good. This is not good. We're riding the tsunami. This actually looks incredible. And we're going over the top. So the AI totally kind of shifted direction. Now, I don't know if that was on purpose or if it's just the way the waves were, but they did it. Like, congratulations. You deserve a medal. Uh, I don't know if we're going down or not. Like, it seems like everything's okay here, but that was nonetheless impressive. So, there you go. There's AI ships and Stormworks. We checked out a cool creation. Thank you guys for all the support on the series. You guys are amazing, and we will see you guys next time in Stormworks.